Hey guys, so I was at Goodwill the other day looking for frames and whatnot, and I found this super cute heart dish. Um, I guess it's candy dish maybe, or for candles, I, I don't know. And then I found this, which is candlestick holder. And we're going to put them together and make a candy dish because I think it's super cute. So we're going to get started. We're going to do the outside of the dish so that we can still use the inside for whatever goes in there. I don't I don't know. I don't think it really matters for like wrap things, which is probably what we'll use it for, but better safe than sorry. So we have all kinds of glitters. We have this really light blue, we have a dark blue, a white, and a silver. And of course, we have our Mod Podge. There we go. So turn this down so you can see. We have to let it dry and do a couple more coats. So we're back with our dishes and they're pretty glittery. I don't know if you can see that or not. It's nice. Um, so last night I was looking at this after it dried and I was originally going to put a blue coat of paint over the outside so that the glitter was more vibrant on the inside but because I painted the outside if I put blue on this it's you're not gonna be able to see the glitter it's not gonna match this so I think I'm just gonna do another thicker coat of glitter on here and then I'm gonna Mod Podge just clear over it to seal it and I think it'll turn out nice so that's what we're doing now. And we're gonna add in, we're gonna throw the glitter on the floor. We're gonna add in a little bit of purple so it's more, has more color, I don't know, because I feel like it.
Hey guys, so we're back with our dish here, and it's pretty, pretty glittery. It's dried. I've put two or three coats of just plain Mod Podge over it, so the glitter's stuck on there pretty well. So now we're going to glue the base to the dish, and I'm going to use this all-purpose glue. I got a three pack of craft glue at the Dollar Tree, so we'll see how this works. If I can open it. Oh. No, I'm scissors. Scissors. I found them. Cut the top off. All right. Back on, back on test now. So I'm just going to use, because this has a circle here, I'm just going to use that and put it into this circle so I can line them up right. And I'm just going to add some glue on here and line those up. Let this dry. I don't know how long it takes to dry. Maybe we'll add another bead of glue around the edge just to make sure it stays. So then we'll let that dry and then we'll come back and fill it with candy. So here's our candy dish. Mm -hmm. It's dried and glittery and sparkly. I don't know if you can tell how sparkly it is. It doesn't look like it, but it is. And of course, for our blue frosty glittery candy dish, we need frozen candy. And good thing this is a small candy dish because some munchkins <laughs> got into my candy because it was open yesterday. I thought I was going to be able to put it in, but the glue took forever to dry. And ate half my candy! I look at it. Kids. But there you go. Now there's pretty blue stuff in the frosty blue frozen kitchen.